Hi, Stephen. Hello. <laughs> Thank you so much for coming to the Riverbend Film Festival this year. And um, you have been a part of the film festival for quite a few years in South Bend and now in Goshen. Yep. So um, you've seen quite an evolution over the years, haven't you? Yep, yep. I've evolved too. I, have, I was looking at some older photos from the earlier festivals and I have a lot more gray now. Yeah, yeah that yeah, happens, doesn't it? It happens really it? fast. <laughs> I think it's been 12 or 13 years, I think, since the oh, first wow. one. Oh, yeah, wow. That's, been that's a while. amazing. That's, that's what I uh, did a little research on. And um, so we have you here as an honoree this year. Yeah. And um, I don't know if you had a chance to flip through the program. I'm sure you, I'm sure you did. But um, we are thrilled to be able uh, to, to present to you later on this evening at your, um, your film screening, uh, Friend of the Fest and Outstanding Achievement in That's Cinema. So well, I'm flattered. I'm very flattered. And it's an easy fest to be a friend of because it's wonderful. And Thank you. I'm, I'm just glad I could come out again. It's been a few years. Thank you so much for all your support. So you have been helping um, with our screenwriting, our screenplay competition for a few years here and there. And uh, um, tell us about your involvement with that a little bit. Well, it's, it's one of my favorite parts of the fest because I, uh, I get to read really, really good screenplays and then you guys make me pick a, f a best or a favorite, which is really hard. Um, but, uh, and, and it's always nice to come because usually I just get to talk to them on the phone after I've read their work and, and this time I actually got to hang out with them, which is really cool. Yeah, that's great. You yeah. met quite a few people yesterday. Yeah. Yeah, I met a lot of people whose scripts I read, and then I met a lot of people whose films I saw on the shorts block and the features, and it's wonderful. That's fantastic. Yeah. Now, you um, are known as a screenplay writer, mm -hmm. um, and you produce as well, if I'm not mistaken, right? Mm -hmm. And um, But recently, your latest film, uh, you get to wear the director's cap, or you did. Uh, yeah. So, yeah. Um, yeah, tell us a little bit about that transition from writing to directing. It was... Um, it was a really interesting, uh, it's, it's, a, it's a very experimental film, so I th it was a really good first project for me to direct. Um, but it was, it was crazy. <clears throat> it was, it's, a, it's a really unique narrative form, and that's kind of one of the reasons I wanted to try it. Um, the original movie, which was called Unfriended, was a movie that took place entirely on a computer screen. Um, and it was told in real time, and it was a Skype conversation. And I remember seeing it in the movie theater, and it just blew me away because it was, I'd never seen anything like it. And you're watching a mouse move around on the screen, and I, my, my hand was moving on my leg, and I, was, I realized I was trying to move the mouse and, and access the computer and look at things. And it's, it's just, a, it was a narrative form. I'd never seen anything mm. like it before, and, um, and no one has really done it since. So um, when, they, when they wanted to talk to me about it, I, I jumped right into it. Fantastic, and yeah. who are they? Oh, the producers, um, Blumhouse and Basilev's Timur Bekmambetov is, a, is a, an amazing filmmaker, um, and Jason Blum, who, who produces some of my favorite movies, and um, neither of whom I've ever worked with before, so it was, a, it was a really interesting opportunity. That seems like it would be like a match made in heaven. Um, yeah. y y your, your projects, their projects, it seems to, it's so we're really excited about seeing and screening uh, Unfriended Dark Web yeah. um, here at Riverbend. I'm very excited for that. What, um, what is next on uh, the agenda for you? You always have so much going on, I'm sure. <laughs> yeah, <clears throat> well, we're, fi we're finishing the film now, um, and delivering it pretty soon, and I'm working on a, a follow-up uh, with Blumhouse, and, um, and I'm just working on a bunch of things. I have a movie that just wrapped um, called Hellfest that's coming out in November. Uh, I have another movie that's casting right now called Bitter, and, um, and I'm working on some TV shows, and one in particular I'm really excited about. We're just kind of waiting to get some news on. And, oh, great. So you yeah. can't share that with us quite yet? Uh, not yet. No. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's not that juicy, though. Um, but uh, but no, I, I really love what's happening in the TV space, and, and I've been sort of flirting with TV for a while, and uh, so this, this one looks interesting. That's fantastic. You have so many yeah. things going on, and you've worn so many hats. Is there... Uh, since you wear primarily three hats when you're working, uh, <laughs> is, is there a particular favorite one? Do you, uh, do you? Not really, no. Although I think, I think I'm, I'm, I enjoy doing one at a time. Um, I mean, I, I did enjoy writing and directing on Unfriended, uh, but uh, one of the fun things about the movie was that I had a ridiculously talented cast of people, a lot of whom had theater experience and stand-up experience. So they were able to take my script, which I had to write very quickly, 
Um, and with only five days of rehearsal, they just filled it out. And, and I, I did a lot of rewriting based on their improvisation, and a lot of their imp improvisation made it into the movie. Um, so in a way, I, I, was, I was able to lean more in the directing because they were sort of breathing new life into the characters and sort of rewriting it themselves, which is really interesting. Um, but I like all three. I mean, they all have sort of different positive aspects and different challenging aspects. And, um, you know, I, I don't think I'm ever going to do a Kenneth Branagh where you, you write, produce, direct, and star. Uh, I admire people who can do that quite immensely, but I, I prefer to focus on one at a time. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Well, again, thank you so much for coming to Goshen, thank Indiana you. this year for the fest. And we are so, so thrilled to be able to honor you this evening at the Riverbend Film Festival. Um, thank you for being a friend. And I know that you're going to uh, you know, be an alumni of ours forever. And we mm -hmm. look forward to, to collaborating more with any of your projects to screen here. As um, long as you'll have me, I'll be here. Oh, we will always have you. <laughs> the door is always open. Thank <laughs> awesome. you so thank much. Thank you very much. Thank you, Stephen. Thank you.